And we know a lot of people are struggling to stay warm in this weather. Marie Saavedra live with that part of the story for us tonight. Marie? John, for most of us, that just means cranking up the heat or maybe putting another blanket on the bed. Still, there are others that have to work hard to find a place that is willing and able to let them in. And there are some that even in this bitter cold would rather stick it out. What cold means to you It's lasted this time means something different. Yes, ma'am. To the man in the second cot from the corner. It's a uh, life or death situation right now, cold as it is out there. Earl Fillmore has been homeless about a year and is trying not to be. There's some good people out there still. But the cold didn't care. A lot of them just don't want to come to places like this. So he made a decision. A lot of people are too proud. For his own safety. Put the pride to the side and come on in. I had to do that too. This is the Garland Overnight Warming Station, or GLOWS. Know that God is here with us. Inside Axe Memorial United Methodist Church. Let us now join our hearts and our spirits together, and let's pray. The last two days, we've had 40 plus. Amen. Staying the night and eating breakfast, lunch, and dinner here at the church. Well, you're right by me now, baby. Volunteers Thank serve you. dinner. You are very welcome, darling. Okay. Enjoy. Okay. To a grateful group. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Feels good. All while wondering about those unwilling to seek out help. You want chili on your hot dog? Okay. Yes. That's just their sense of mind, and you can't understand it. I don't understand it, and I don't think anybody understands it. I know about 20 or 30 of them that's in the woods. That is a risk uh, Fillmore won't take. The fort. Right there in that, in that tray up there. And because GLOWS exists, he and 40 others. Because you might not wake up. Aren't forced to. You might not wake up out of this cold. In Garland. That's for real. Marisa Vedra, Channel 8 News.